Crabbing in Maryland is a favored family recreational pastime for many homeowners with waterfront property. Our state reptile, the diamondback terrapin, also lives in the same waters that crabs call home. In addition to challenges such as loss of nesting habitat, air-breathing terrapins also face the risk of drowning when they are lured inside a family's crab pot. A simple act of installing a bycatch reduction device, or BRD, onto the crab pot keeps larger terrapins out while permitting large crabs to enter. Let's review the steps for installing your bycatch reduction device. The same baits that lure blue crabs into crab pots also attract diamondback terrapins. Unfortunately for the terrapin, being trapped underwater over time, this air-breathing reptile will eventually drown in a crab pot. Turtle excluders are available in either metal or plastic. The turtle excluder should be positioned in the narrow back end of each entry funnel. To install a metal ring into a crab pot, one can use hog rings and hog ring pliers to attach it into each funnel. The hog ring should be looped around the crab pot wire and the excluder device and drawn tightly closed with the pliers. The excluder should be firmly attached at each corner. Additional attachments should be made to keep the device firmly in place. A plastic excluder device can be installed in a funnel using plastic cable ties. A tie should be looped through the wire of the crab pot and then pulled firmly closed. Once all the cable ties have been installed, the excess cable should be trimmed off. The Diamondback Terrapin is prevented from entering the pot due to its higher shell. It cannot go through the excluder ring, which are one and three quarter inches high by four and three quarter inches wide. This prevents the Terrapin from ever entering a trap, but allows large legal size crabs to enter the trap. Different types of traps used to catch crabs include the crab pot, which is baited and left in overnight, completely submerged, and crab traps, which are collapsible and have to be actively worked to catch crabs. Crab traps are completely terrapin friendly, uh, will not cause drowning with terrapins. Crab pots, however, because they are submerged underwater for long periods of time, can cause drowning for diamondback terrapins. Waterfront property owners are allowed to crab with a maximum of two crab pots. And by law, these must be equipped with BRDs on each entry funnel. Crab pots can be purchased at fishing supply stores or hardware stores, sometimes with BRDs already installed. BRDs, also known as turtle excluder devices, are also sold separately at many fishing and crabbing supply stores. Let's all work together to save our Maryland terrapins.